else. All right. Okay. So uh, today we are going to have a complete IELTS speaking test. You know that the test has three parts, part one, part two, and part three. At time to time, I'll mm. give you the instructions as to how you can follow everything. And for our further uh, marking purpose, we are going to record all the test. So are you ready? Uh, should we go through the speaking test? Yes. All right. So uh, without any further delay, let's get started. For part two, let me uh, tell you, I will share the screen. And for part three, okay, I tell you're able to share everything. Okay, so let's get started. Anyway, what's your full name? Okay. My name is Ahud Ahmed Dahmani. Okay, do you work or study? Uh, I finished study. Uh, I graduated from United Arab Emirates University. And I have a Bachelor in Linguistics. And uh, from uh, one month ago, I got a job as a teacher assistant, but I didn't start yet. Maybe we will start next academic year. Okay, so do you have any hobbies? Yes, my favorite hobbies are uh, drawing and uh, gardening. Okay, so uh, let's talk about sleep. How many hours do you usually sleep at night? Uh, about uh, maybe seven hours or eight hours. Uh, do you sometimes sleep during a daytime? No, I don't prefer that because I uh, later I will feel head headache. Hmm. Uh, so what do you do if you don't get sleep at night? Again, sir. Uh, what do you do if you can't get sleep uh, at night? Uh, maybe I will watch TV until I feel that I want to sleep. Okay, so do you ever remember the dreams you have had while you were asleep? No, when I wake up, I don't remember what I uh, dream. Uh, well, uh, some people believe that uh, at late night, okay, if you uh, have a dream, okay, that comes to the true of reality. Do you believe it? Uh, no. This is different. It's not uh, real things. All right, so this is the mm -hmm. end of the IELTS speaking test part one. Let's move on part two. In this portion of the test, you'll be given a card. Now, of course, you'll be given some time to take some preparation. I'll give you time to give instructions. Right. Yes, sir, I hear you now. Okay, uh, so uh, now uh, you can see here on the screen, okay, a question with the cue card. Okay, you will have some time for preparation. Of course, I'll tell you how much, and it is one minute, you know that. Just to get some preparation. Okay. So if you are already prepared, then we may get started. So, dear uh, candidate, your one minute preparation time is just now. So uh, are we ready? Uh, okay. Uh, yes. Okay. Okay. You have uh, taken your one minute preparation time. So, uh, your one minute preparation time is up. Play this to the speak. Okay. Yeah. So start speaking, please.
Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, you're one Did minute. Did we take? Yeah, you're one minute. Uh, uh, I. Yeah. Didn't you? Uh, okay, 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 <laughs> okay, okay. So, okay, that's all right. So, uh, your past is past. You okay? Uh, this is the second part of your IELTS speaking test. Uh, in this portion, okay. you'll be given a card. So here you can see the card. Now you will have one minute time to take some preparation. Your one minute preparation can be start now. Okay. Yeah, just a while ago, okay, I just checked it. Uh, I think we were experiencing some network issue. Yeah, it's the perfect now. I think the problem has been solved. Yeah. So yeah, once nice. again, once again, I'm going to uh, request you, okay, uh, for the part two. Uh, so dear candidate, your one minute preparation time starts now. Right, so you one minute uh, yes. preparation time is up. Please start speaking. Okay. Uh, I bought uh, a coffee table uh, from uh, home center in uh, city center Fujairah. Uh, it is a wooden table. Uh, it's very useful and uh, I uh, bought it because I have uh, many uh, packets of coffees at home and I need to organize them. Also, I like to drink coffee uh, two times or three times a day. And uh, I have uh, two kids, so I need to uh, organize that uh, far uh, from my children. Uh, I bought uh, this one maybe three months ago. Three months ago, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, okay. So, dear candidate, this is the end so, of your IELTS taking test part two. Let's move on part three, and in this portion of the test. Okay, we ask more questions. Okay. So let's get it started. Okay, and uh, now I'm going to ask some questions about creating a nice home. So on the screen also you can see the questions for your ready reference. Why do some people buy lots of things for their home? They want uh, to decorate their home and make uh, it more organizer. Uh, so and, do you think? Uh, it is very expensive to make a home uh, look nice. No, there is uh, many uh, uh, shops can make uh, cheap and beautiful things with less price and with uh, good quality. Mm, so why don't some people care about their home looks? Uh, maybe they don't stay at home uh, too much uh, mm -hmm. and they uh, have kids at home and the kids are uh, uh, starting to play and uh, disturbing the place. All right. So maybe. let's talk about different types of homes. You know, what ways? 
is living in a flat or apartment better than living in a house? I think living in house is more comfort uh, comfortable because uh, we have uh, yard in a house, but uh, for apartment, uh, I think it's uh, without. It's, it's uh, not the question. In what ways is living in a flat is better than living in a house? All right, let's move on to the next person. Do you think homes will uh, look different in the future? Uh, yes, I think it will be more uh, uh, using uh, smart homes mm -hmm. and uh, for uh, they can control the how to use and for example open the lights and uh, the TVs uh, by using smart uh, phones, maybe. Okay. Uh, and so the homes in the future, it will be more developed mm. and modern. Uh, okay, so do we agree that the kinds of homes people prefer change as they get older? It depends on the people. Uh, the people who like uh, the smart things, they will and the technologies, they will like that, and it will be more comfortable for them to use it. Uh, but for other people, maybe they just need a normal home, as uh, they can. Uh, uh, build their home with a special designer, maybe. Okay, this is the end of it. I also speaking. Chris, have a great day ahead. Uh, right, okay, first of all, con con uh, congratulations, and you have done the job. But I have some observation. In the meantime, okay. are you happy with the test you have just taken? Yes, but uh, in some uh, question, I I just be silent. Uh, uh, actually, in part one, you need to okay, and uh, answer the question. Okay, a little longer. I mean, not simply yes. a sentence having three words or four words. Try to make two to three sentences at least. Sentence, I mean, make the sense clear. Okay. Otherwise, okay. okay, the examiner will realize that you have some problems with the fluency. In part two, uh, you will start it very well. I'm pleased that way you will start answering the question. But you fail to elaborate your ideas according. In part three, okay, I, I asked you a question. Why do, well, I asked you a simple question that uh, in uh, what ways? Is living in a flat is better than in a house. Unfortunately, you started talking about house. I mean, of uh, course. So you need to understand that question. Part three is more detailed. No. Okay? Uh, but I believe if you practice for some reason, it is a practice test, remember. This is how you can realize or you can assess yourself whether you are getting improvement or not. So I highly recommend you to take mock tests as better or as many as you can, because it will make you confident, it will make you understand, okay, what will happen with your exam. Any congratulations? Yeah, now here you go with your question, okay. if we have any. So no, far. thank you, sir, I don't have a question. And okay. also, I, yes, I know that I need to practice more. Yeah, exactly. So. Uh, for this speaking, okay, you will get the uh, max saver IQ, the highest five, uh, band five, but band five isn't enough. You have uh, good fluency. Okay. You can practice in a regular basis. You will have to be at least six to 6.5 if possible. But for fluency, okay, you need to speak more. I mean, as more as okay. you can, as better as you can. Don't focus on your grammar. 
lexical resources just focus on your answer and of course focus on its fluency that will ensure your desired band score right okay okay